Digital manipulatives have used a variety of programming models ranging from record and play, which is immediate but limited, as in Curlybot, to symbolic programming, which is extensible but harder to learn, as in Lego Mindstorms. Each of these paradigms has advantages and limitations, but in the design of digital manipulatives, they have existed separately. Backpacks are tangible interfaces that retain the immediacy and emotional engagement of record and play and incorporate some of the flexibility and sophistication of control structures, feedback, and parameterization of data, all concepts that are part of a traditional programming paradigm. Backpacks build on the Topopo system presented at CHI 2004, which allows children to experiment with dynamic physics concepts through the playful creation of walking robots. Record and play had serious limitations. Children could edit their physical models, but could not edit their motion records, and Topobo was a closed system with creatures that could not respond to external stimuli. Backpacks allowed children to fine-tune fundamental parameters of movement, like phase shift, amplitude, frequency, and offset with the push of a button and the turn of a knob. When a backpack is attached to an active, by default it affects only that active, but pushing the button will cause the backpack to affect all actives in the structure. When the backpack is removed, its effect disappears. We present four types of backpacks with different motion manipulation capabilities and with varying manipulation control of a knob or ambient sensors. The faster, slower backpack will change the speed of playback of an active. In this galloping creature, children can explore ideas related to resonance by determining how a creation may move more quickly even if the active itself is moving more slowly. The bigger, smaller backpack scales the recorded motion of an active. Motions are scaled relative to the start position of the recording. The time delay backpack can be used to explore how a creature with actives moving in the same way can walk in different directions based on phase shifts. Time delay can also be used to explore resonance in waves and distributed structures like this caterpillar. This illustrates the peer-to-peer -peer behaviors that backpacks elicit when attached to a queen. Phase shifts are distributed through the creation based on its network topology. The offset backpack will offset the angular orientation of a child's recording based on ambient light. Instead of a knob, this backpack has two light sensors at the end of its wire antenna, causing a motion to lean towards the most brightly lit sensor. Children can use it to create a creature whose posture changes in response to light. For example, they may create walking creations that always walk towards light, or by switching the antenna, walk away from light. Many creatures can walk forward and backward based on subtle phase shifts in their movements. This creation can navigate towards light because the knob on its time delay backpack has been replaced with light sensors. We tested the backpacks with children aged 6 to 15 in informal play environments in the classroom of a physics by design class. With backpacks, children can experiment with motion, dissecting and analyzing it in parts, addressing questions like, what exactly makes this creature walk the way it does? We found that the backpacks were an accessible interface for children to explore different parameters and introduced a set of concepts that range in complexity. These same parameters are embodied in mathematical models of linear systems, the primary closed form solvable way to deal with dynamic systems. Children who are able to analyze and intuitively understand their creation's behaviors in terms of backpacks may be able to transfer these ideas to other representations of dynamic systems.